¿Cómo están? Oh. Saludos de Shaha. Estamos aquí en Felician en nuestra cafetería. Bueno, déjame que quito la cuenta. Es que hace rato tenía mucho calor. <laughs> so, oh yeah, so actually we need to speak in uh, English because we have a new guest. So. Hey, what's up? <laughs> This is Pascal. He works with us. He works with us in the same school. And nice to meet you guys. David. Hello. Ni hao. So where are you from? Hola, como estas? Where are you from? The... Uh, India. And? Switzerland. And Mexico. Oiga, si ya me dio mucho calor. Bueno, empiecenme. So nothing. The idea is that I just wanted to ask them uh, some questions so for you guys to realize like what is it like that bring us here sometimes in China. And uh, for example, me, let me start. I came here five years ago. Uh, first, I was in Beijing. Well, I already told you that. And uh, I don't know. It's been like um, you know, very different experience because sometimes you're expecting something, and sometimes some things they don't work. But so let me ask Pascal. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we should have. A, so what do you think? You've been here for how long? Yeah, I'm uh, in China for about uh, almost six years soon. So six years. Yeah, quite some time. I think we came about the same time to China. Different places, yeah. I think, but they're around the same time. But you were first in Hainan? First in uh, Xi'an. Oh, Where Xi'an is where the Terracotta yes. Warriors are, you know? Los Guerreros de Terracotta. Creo que por ahí tengo un video. So that was... Uh, that was uh, 2013. Uh, 2013. So how was Xi'an? Yeah, good. I mean, very different in Shanghai. It's a uh, well, much smaller city, of course. I remember when I arrived in Xi'an, they told me... You've been in Xi'an? No. I haven't been to Xi'an. <laughs> so what is that? They told me, why you come to Xi'an? It's such a small city, right? Why don't you go to Shanghai? So I was laughing because Xi'an alone is uh, more population in whole Switzerland. <laughs> so for me it was uh, a bit funny to hear. How many in Switzerland? Two uh, Switzerland, eight. Eight million. Eight million. So, well, not yeah. super small. Okay, so eight million. Eight million. And then Xi'an also around eight, eight, nine million. In Xi'an. In Xi'an alone, right? So they so. look alike, no? Switzerland and Xi'an. Yeah, same, same. Similar. 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 Yeah. Which stands for? Central Business District. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Thank you. So, okay. And then after Xi'an, you were. I went uh, to uh, Hainan. Oh, so Hainan is La Isla. Oh, you yeah. said? It's uh, all the way in the south. Say in of Spanish, no? Si. And uh, Tutu uh, down there. <laughs> no, so it's an island in South, um, south China. Well, south China Sea, yeah. So they have uh, a lot of tourism going on there. They also call it the uh, Chinese Hawaii. Uh, it's actually very nice, but the thing is that a lot of people is coming now. It's like over visited in a way. Yeah, especially uh, during the holidays, it's going to be crazy. Yeah. And I think now it's like very, very expensive. No? Yeah. No. Expensive. And so after, after that you came to Shanghai? Yeah, after uh, some regions there I transferred to Shanghai. And then yeah. since what around uh, yeah, pretty much three, three and a half years, I'm in Shanghai now. Yeah, they are Chongwen Koyama. Fukui. Because we're almost on the same level of Chino. So actually, he knows much better. This one here. <laughs> he knows much better Chinese, no? So I tell us a bit. So say no, but say loud because. Oh, uh, what's your name? <laughs> no, so David is de India. <laughs> so David is de India. Este, de hecho, eh, when was it? Like last year we last were in year. India, no? Last year summer, no? Or was it winter? That was winter. Winter, winter. holiday. Yeah, there was some video, I'm going to put it there. So I was actually traveling with him, with Pascal, and then we met uh, David in uh, Varanasi. Yeah. That was one of the best places we've been, actually, uh, that I've been like very excited. That was very good. So, for how long have you been here? In China. Are we uh, in China? <laughs> Not in the cafeteria. <laughs> we just came to the cafeteria. We came to uh, uh, 11 years. 11 years. 11 years, man. That's long. I told you earlier. No. <laughs> I just didn't believe you would say it in camera. <laughs> 11 years, yeah, 11 years. Uh, 2007. But then you came straight from where? From Singapore. Uh, so, David was uh, working in Singapore, no? For, for how long? Seven years. For seven years. Seven years, huh? Seven years. Also a teacher there, no? Yeah. I actually was working there in this university in Singapore and I was working in this university in uh, Vietnam but they're the same and then I was going to be transferred to Singapore but then it didn't work, some visa issues uh, and then yeah, so after Singapore you came to China yeah so what do you like up here? Uh, I mean, because you've been 11 years, no? yeah 
Well, the heart is here, so I have to be here. But uh, apart from that, the job is nice. And the friends are good. Yeah. The, the coffee is so so. <laughs> but yeah, I just like the place. Eh? Like the place, huh? You mean uh, this uh, this little bakery with the lighting, everything is good. Yeah, because for example, sometimes we go to downtown or something, and that is very different. Like for example, what I was just telling you in some other videos, like you can have everything in Shanghai. It's like how many millions in Shanghai? 26, people. 26, 26. 26. So we have in Mexico City, for example, to compare also like 25 million. Oh, in India? In India? Mumbai, how big? More, maybe. 28. Yeah, about the same. All these are yeah, high density cities. Mumbai 20. was very nice, so we were there as well. Bombay, uh, okay, Mumbai, or Chennai, where I'm from. Delhi, how much? Uh, Delhi, all, uh, Calcutta, all 25, 26 million. Yeah. High density. So when we were there last year in Mumbai, it was also, I don't know what you noticed, but it was also like kind of the city that has the highest, higher, or I don't know, the highest standards in in India or Mumbai. not really. Yeah, yeah like for I example, like compared like to Shanghai yeah. or Mumbai to Delhi, as to say Shanghai to Beijing, or as to say Ho Chi Minh City to Hanoi in yeah, Vietnam. A little bit like this. It's always like the capital, let's say the economic, the well, official capital, political. political. And then you also have this other city, which is uh, probably even more developed. Financial, financial, the financial capital. The financial. Yeah. So here, for example, in China, is Same it? In Switzerland, even yeah. Bern and Zurich. Ah. Right? Now, Bern is the political yeah. capital, but then it's not half as, as developed as Zurich. Zurich. Yeah. So, Zurich is the most like. Yeah. Yeah. Zurich then much bigger, much more developed. Oh, nice, okay. nice. Yeah. And in Mexico City, for example, we, we also have uh, Mexico City, Mexico. No, but it's everything there. Then we have Monterrey as the biggest city, and then South Cancun and Puebla. <laughs> and then Puebla. Uh, Guadalajara. Oh. So, yes. Yeah, so, yeah, so we have many things here like. Um, so of course it's really like depending on you what kind of like circles you want to be in the city because it's for everything. And then there's some things that you like, some things you don't like. Uh, but now we just want to give the idea about the things. So for how long we've been in China, what makes us stay. So in my case it's basically just the, kind of like the job. Chocolate, eh? Mm. Hey, shoot to the camera, no? <laughs> Uh, so it's just the job and uh, it's good because they give us also like holidays in a way, so that's a good thing. And uh, what else do you like about Also I think the work, uh, work environment is kind of good. Very multinational, like you can see here, we're just three random guys there from the school, but yeah. it's like very, uh, got different countries, different backgrounds, different cultures. So that's always kind of makes it interesting also. Yeah, yeah it's true because then sometimes we just gather something and then we have many different uh, views on the same topic, let's say. So then you can actually like get to speak and uh, interact and, <laughs> and fight some. <laughs> and fight this right? And they try to find a balance uh, field and stuff. But it's good, it's good. So uh, that's what is China here, what it's been for me in Shanghai so far. And um, then let's see for how long. He's good, he's a good moderator. Good moderator, yeah. Alright. <laughs> Alright, so I'll leave you with my coffee here. My for example, here. just for you to have an idea. Uh, this it's is like a, a fake Starbucks. It's like, yeah, actually it looks like <laughs> a fake Starbucks, you see? Uh, well, we're gonna make another video about the fake stuff. But yeah, this is like the Starbucks. So this one has... Sorry, how much it's was not it? fake Starbucks. Look at the logo. It's not fake. Hey, these <laughs> guys, everything fake. <laughs> it's not. A little fake logo. chocolate cake at least. Yeah, fake chocolate. <laughs> yeah, okay. So yeah, so, un americano, ¿cuánto costó? How much is this? Uh, 12. 12. 12 yuanes. About 1.5 uh, uh, dollars. 1.5 yuan. Dollars. Uh, dollars. 1.5. So, but then, once you go to the city downtown, mm -hmm. then everything goes like... Double. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, you can more. Alright guys, uh, we're gonna leave you here. Anything you would like to add? Uh, yes. Thank you for watching. <laughs> Thank hit you subscribe, so hit subscribe ah. to the channel. <laughs> hit subscribe yeah. and click comment. Bueno, cuídense chicos, nos vemos. Saludos, Pascal. Adios amigos. Yo y Davidos. Davidos. Chao, chao.